Hey, it is Greg Milby for Kentucky's Heartland. Welcome to another Work Matters segment brought to you by the Kentucky Career Center Lincoln Trail. When local employers need to fill positions, area staffing agencies are often who they turn to. Staffing agencies, they play a key role in workforce development, including right here in the growing Lincoln Trail area. To share a little more about their services, I'm joined by Gwen Patterson, Operations Manager for Express Employment Professionals in Elizabethtown. Gwen, thanks for your time today. Good morning, Greg. It's a pleasure. Well, it's a pleasure to talk with you too. So, Gwen, the job market, always changing, always changing. So how does Express Employment Professionals adapt to ensure that job seekers find the right fit for their skills and experiences? We try to keep a an approach uh, with our employers and our associates as well on something that's very fluid and changes all the time because we're having to adapt to the employer's needs, the associate needs, the community needs as well. Um, so that we can make sure that everything is fitting together. Hmm. Okay. So what strategies do you use to help match these job seekers? You know, the different skills, different experiences with the demands of the potential employers. We, t- we try to look at what an, an employee has, what they can bring to the table for an employer, what skills that they have that will transfer across to what an employer is going to need. We do some testing. Uh, we do some um, um, where we take their skills and work with the employers to make sure that they will come across and be able to do what the employers are needing at the job site. We also have several insights that we can provide to the employers. Our corporate uh, is great about doing a lot of surveys and everything about what current employers are looking for, the skills they need. And we also have an email that we send out to employers every month that talks about the new changes and new things that are going on in the in the market so that they will kind of see what changes they might need to look at uh, adapting to to get employees and to keep them at the work site. Okay. So what positions are currently like the hot thing? What what are the in demand jobs right now? Um, actually, I'm going to have to say a little bit of everything. We have warehouse jobs. We have forklift jobs. We have machinist jobs. We have AutoCAD positions. We have some very entry level positions. We also go on the other side with the clerical type positions of doing accounting, administrative, uh, operations positions. Uh, so we kind of run the entire gamut of A to Z on what's going on right now in the job market. Okay. Um, so another question here is, uh, for those watching that are just learning about this opportunity, can you share a little bit, a little bit of a, a deeper dive onto the specifics, what specific ways that the, uh, the collaboration between staffing agencies, employers, job seekers, and workforce development agencies like the Kentucky career center, Lincoln trail has improved the local workforce and created opportunities for our region. So there's such a huge change going on in the job market right now in our area with the new battery plant that's coming with the companies that are coming to support them. It's they need a whole new skill set than what we are accustomed to seeing in this area. So that is an adaptation that everyone is having to make right now. And so we're working with that with different employers. We're trying to work with employees on that as well as the employer employers. And the Kentucky Career Center is great about this. They're doing a lot of things as far as they are doing the virtual job fair, which they're holding one today. And we've been participating in that. We've been able to find employees on that. Uh, We recently participated in a job fair with them at the American Legion here in Elizabethtown, where we could do face-to-face. On Tuesdays, they have uh, meet the employer where different employers go and set up at the career center and you can come in an employee as well as a potential employer can come in and meet with those people as well to say, Hey, how can we partner up? How can we partner up to make us both be successful in what's going on right now? So that's just to name a few, but the career center has been very beneficial to this community and trying to make sure that things that programs that they're offering 
to individuals in this community are a, a great benefit to everyone because it's helpful if I'm not, you know, if I'm able to sit at my desk and to continue work, but still do interviews with people during this virtual job fair, as well as for them to be able to run out to their car on a break or, you know, if they have to be at home for a specific reason uh, for that day, then they can still participate in that virtual job fair. Awesome. Yeah, it, it is. I think some people don't really understand the opportunities that they have that uh, are right in front of them that can help them, you know, get into that job that they love or that career opportunity that maybe they haven't uh, had the opportunity to step into. There's, there's some great opportunities around this community. Absolutely. I think a lot of times people don't often understand that they have a dream of a specific job or opportunity. And maybe while they can't jump straight into that, that's one way that a staffing company can assist them because maybe we can help them get headed down that path in a different direction, but so that they can get to that job that they're looking for. Yeah. And you never know where any experience is going to take you. Look, I started doing radio 20 some odd years ago. I never expected I'd be doing a show from my basement and I never expected that I'd be doing video interviews from my basement. You just, you got that skill. And over the period of time that could advance into some, some pretty interesting stuff. Absolutely. That's where I tell people, if there's an opportunity given to you, you need to really seriously look at it. I, I could not begin to tell you how many people that I have placed in a full term job where they went starting as that they were just going to cover for somebody for vacation for a week. And they have ended up being hired by the company are now very successful in that position in that company. So there's all kinds of opportunities all the time in so many different directions. Yeah. It's like an on the job interview. So that's, uh, that's absolutely. So Gwen, thanks again for your time today. I know it's, it's precious and I appreciate you sharing this information. So uh, folks are a little more aware of what's going on here in our community. So appreciate you uh, joining me today. Thanks, Greg. All right. To learn more about the Kentucky Career Center Lincoln Trail, you can visit ltcareercenter.org or you can give them a call too at 270-766-5115. I'm Greg Milby, Community Storyteller, and this has been our monthly Work Matters segment brought to you by the Kentucky Career Center Lincoln Trail.